It's an exciting time in gastric cancer. There are now two uh, validated targets, including uh, HER2 and the VEGF pathway, and we have inhibitors against these to use, and so these are um, providing meaningful survival benefits to our patients. Also, there are some additional drugs that are being looked at to target these pathways, and it's hoped that they're going to show some improvement. Um, I also went over some exciting data looking at immunotherapy. Um, there's an explosion of studies looking at um, immune checkpoint inhibition in gastric cancer, and uh, the early data show a lot of promise, and so we'll wait to see what the um, larger uh, phase three studies are going to show. There are two studies that have been completed, a expansion phase 1b uh, with pembrolizumab, which is a monoclonal antibody targeting PD-1, um, and that was looked at in a selected patient population who had PD-L1 positive tumors, and it showed a overall response rate of about 22% with quick um, uh, responses, a median uh, time to response of eight weeks. Um, and then there is a more recently a PDL1 um, phase 1B study looking at um, avolumab, which um, was tested in 20 second line patients and 55 patients um, who had progressed on, excuse me, who had um, responded to first line treatment and were put on the uh, PDL1 inhibitor as maintenance, and uh, this showed some very positive um, responses as well. So early studies, um, and now we're going to see if those will be uh, confirmed in bigger, bigger studies.